What's up my lady loves, I'm Poke Cinema, and welcome back to Pokemon Light Platinum Version. In the last episode, I asked you guys to pick my starter Pokemon, and it was a landslide. Charmander won by, let's just say, a lot of votes. Uh, Squirtle, of course, came in second place. And then in last place was Bulbasaur. I already chose Bulbasaur for a uh, Let's Play, so I figured uh, people wouldn't vote for it, and you didn't, so awesome. Anyway, we're gonna have to battle this Team Steam member. If you remember last time we left off, he was trying to get the secrets to the universe. So now let's go ahead and destroy his Poochiana. I'm gonna speed this up. I'm gonna be speeding up all the trainer battles and all of the wild Pokemon battles, but not the gym battles. Well, Professor, this time you were lucky, but next time I'll kidnap you. And from this point on, Tommy is on Team Steam. Team Steam's hitless. Oh, okay, well. He looked like a normal guy to me. I'm surprised he's actually evil. He looked pretty normal. Whatever. Thank you very much, but now Team Steam will be after you. So I'll give you this Pokemon to protect yourself. Take care of it, train hard to challenge the Zephyr League, and always be ready to fight Team Steam. Alright, so now we officially get our Charmander. I'm going to nickname him Gunter after the Gunter Pepper. I don't know if you've heard of it. It's kind of like not a really popular Pepper, but hey, Gunter it is, so... We're gonna name you Gunter. I figured it was a pretty clever name. Okay, Tommy, let's go back to my la lab in Yellowtown. What, why am I saying lab? Go back to my lab. All right, well, let's walk over here and just talk to her really quick. Hi, Tommy, welcome to my lab. Thanks for pressing, I'm ready to help you now. Okay, now you have to find your, now that you have your first Pokemon, I think you should train to become the Pokemon Master by challenging the Zephyr League and its eight gyms. Alright, so it looks like we're going to challenge the 8 gyms, just like any other game. So yeah, we'll be making our way to the next town, though, in the city. And we'll be hopefully taking on some gym leaders, so let's go ahead and go. I'm going to talk to the mom, though. Maybe she'll give me my running shoes or something. I don't know. I don't even know how to get running shoes in this, so I really hope it's by talking to her because I, I want my running shoes. So, what's up, ho? Hey, Tommy, you're the pride of my life. I, okay, yeah, I love you too, ho. But no running shoes. Alright, that sucks. Um... Hmm, let's go ahead and talk to these guys. I heard that you can get a lot of Pokemon by talking to the people in cities, so I'm just gonna look around and talk to these guys. I'm sure they... Oh, a gift for my journey. A max potion, that's nice. Okay, so be sure to talk to that chick. Keep in mind, this is a blind Let's Play, so I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm sure you guys don't really know what I'm doing either. But these trainers are pretty tough, so I'm gonna be training up to level 7. So let's just, let's just speed this up really quick and scratch the crap out of things because we're gonna have some trouble training our Pokemon. I actually don't know where to heal up in the city. That's probably something I should go look for right now, actually. Let's go, let's go have a look around. Um, I think maybe we just heal at the lab. I'm surprised the mom doesn't heal you, but I wanna talk to this fat guy really quick over here. Yo, fatty, what's up? Today's technology is incredible. I can trade Pokemon with people from around the world. Alright, some generic. Some generic stuff there, that's cool. Maybe we talk to the healing machine. Are you a healing machine? That's the healing machine, okay. Hello, you? Hello, you? You? Heal my Pokemon? Something about mysteries and challenges of... Challenges, okay. You wanna heal my Pokemon then? Before you leave, here's a little gift. Oh, here's a Pokeball? We should've talked to her again, that was terrible. Why didn't I do that? These Pokeballs, something good luck on your journey. Very good, Tommy. Seems like you were born to be a legendary trainer. I'll be following you. Wait, let's come in. I think that was a glitch. Wait, let's talk to her again. Okay, no, it wasn't a glitch. All right, I thought there might be a glitch. All right, how do I how do I get how do I heal though? I am confused. Um, let's just whoa, my audio kind of pooped out there. All right, well let's just check around these houses. Okay, we can't go past there. I'm trying to figure out how to heal my Pokemon though, because it's actually gonna bother me if I can't heal before going. It's gonna be terrible. All right, uh, you heal me. One of you. I love grass Pokemon. They're so strong, and cute, and ready for any battle. Okay. That's great. Pokemon equipped it with Quick Claw can go faster than others, blah, blah, blah. Well, that's, that's a great tip. Give me Quick Claw, okay? Nope, okay. You don't want to give me anything. Let's go check out this house really quick. I'm going to speed this up, though, because I really, really just want to find where I can heal. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Oh, a Thunderstone. That's nice. All right. I'll definitely keep that for later. You might actually need that. In fact, hmm, I don't know. I've taken a look around the next city that we actually need to get to. And there's some really cool things that you can do there. Like, you can get some really nice Pokemon there, and you can also uh, get, yeah, just some really nice Pokemon, and you get some gifts. So, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk to this bed. Maybe I can heal myself by going in here. No, really? Okay, fine. Let's just get the potion out of here, though. No, we can't even get an RPC. How am I supposed to heal? I don't even know. Maybe we'll just die, and that'll work. But, okay, let's just go ahead and train up, I guess. 
I don't really understand how I'm supposed to heal, but whatever. Uh, I'll only use my max potion if I really need it, so I'll just save that. Oh god, I am dead. Well, that's fine with me. I get full health now, so that's great. <laughs> you guys are probably like, wow, Cinema, you noob, you heal up over here. Well, I don't know. I'm, I'm new to this hack, just like probably some of you are that are watching right now. So why I trained up to level 8 or level 7 is because now I have Ember and I can just destroy this guy right here because the trainers are really strong in this game. It's actually pretty weird. So all right, let's go for an Ember there. Gain two levels. Look at that good EXP. That is crazy. 217. That is insane. So you gain levels really fast. The EXP system is pretty good, but the only thing is a lot of the Pokemon are really high leveled. Ooh, a secret item. Let's let's get this. It's not really a secret item, but there's an item here at least. Uh, I'm gonna talk to that rock. Okay, nothing. That's great. The graphics on this game really look amazing though, but I've never really played a hack 100% through, so I'm really excited to be playing this through because it looks amazing. I Something that I've always wanted to do though is let's play a hack, so I'm really glad that I'm actually getting to do it. Plus the hack showcases. The hack showcases have definitely been fun so far to record. Oh, a nice, a nice Starly. Okay, that's great. When a Pokemon is poison, you should use the antidote to cure it. Yeah. Oh, really? No dip. No, no crap. What is that though? What is this? Looks like a berry tree. Delicious berries to pick. Okay. I think I need a berry picker for that, but that's cool. Maybe there is an item named berry picker. I don't know. Maybe I'm just bullcrapping, but let's go ahead and fight this guy really quick. So you get really high leveled, like I said, really fast, because I'm already level 13, and we aren't even at the first gym or at the first town, so this is really, really awesome. I get taken down, fool. And I can't really train any other Pokemon, but I'm going to be catching a couple Pokemon right now. Ooh, an item, though. I want this. Let me get that. A potion. Okay, that's cool. But yeah, I'm going to be catching a couple Pokemon in this episode, as well as receiving a gift Pokemon. Not really... Uh, to use, but I just want to get the gift Pokemon. So let's uh, let's go ahead and go to the the Poke the Poke Center though first. So where is this? Where is this at? Right here. Okay, let's heal up our Pokemon. But if you come here and you actually go to the right over here, keep walking. And this guy in the glasses right here, he will give you a Growlithe. So that's really something cool. And if you actually did choose Squirtle or Bulbasaur, I would definitely recommend picking up this Growlithe. It's really nice. I don't think you can actually nickname it, but it's really cool. I, I really like that they did that in the game. But here's the Safari Zone, which is something I freaking love. It's in the first route of the game, and they give you great Pokemon. So I'm going to go in the Safari Zone, and I'm going to catch me some Pokemon right now. So let's go ahead and go to the uh, the Desert Zone. That's where our first Pokemon is going to be that we're going to want to catch. So let's just speed this up. Drillbur, we don't want you. We don't want a Trap Inch, even though Trap Inch is really good because then you can get a Flygon. That's just not the Pokemon we're looking for. Uh, not you either. I guess it's kind of one of the rarer ones in here. Not Drillbur either. Man, I'm surprised they made these things so common. Okay, uh, you're not what I want. Come on, I know you're here. You were here just the other day. Alright, um, Shellos, what are you doing here? I think he's here. I saw him here, I think. Uh, let me keep running around, I guess. Where are you, where are you at? Shellos, really? Shellos, you're not, you're not, what? I'm confused. Oh, here he is. Okay. I was about to give up on him, but let's go ahead and throw a Pokeball. And awesome, we caught Scraggy in one Pokeball. That's amazing. What? He's 190 pounds. That's crazy. All right, well, let's give a nickname to Scraggy. Um, I'm going to nickname him Swaggy after my friend Callum because, I don't know, he said nickname him Swaggy. That's the first thing he said, and I was like, you know what? You know what? That's crazy enough to work. So where is G? GG and Y. Alright, Swaggy. Swaggy the Scraggy. I'll level him up off screen, I think. Uh, so let's go ahead and retire this place. And then let's go back. It seems the audio quality is like flipping out when I speed up. This is weird. It's never really done this to me before, but let's go ahead and go to the ice zone. Maybe I'll get it fixed in the next episode. I don't know what's going on with this, but yeah, we're going to the ice zone now because the next Pokemon we're going to catch is right in this route. So not Swine Up either. Okay. Uh, here it is, actually. That was pretty fast, so let's go ahead and catch that. Snorunt, and, uh, wait. We don't want that Snorunt. We want a different one. This one is the one we want. Alright, let's catch him. Alright, well now we caught Snorunt, and we're going to name it Monroe. So now we got three Pokemon already. Let's hope I spell this correctly. Monroe. Like that. Okay. We're gonna name it Monroe after Malin Monroe, of course. But here, we're gonna retire now. 
And let's go ahead and go back to the Pokemon Center and heal our Pokemon up really quickly. Alright, so I think there... I don't even know what there is in this town. What is this? Let's see what this is. Pokemon Contest. Okay, Contest. We don't really need to go there. Yes, I want to restore my Pokemon. And let's go ahead and deposit one of our Pokemon really quickly, though. We're not going to need uh, an extra snow nut here on our team. Nor are we going to need this Growlithe, so there we go. Let's actually try to train up Scraggy. I'm kind of curious on how they got this guy in and what they're using to sprite him. And wow, the menu looks amazing. I haven't seen the menu. All right, let's go left, I guess. No, hey, don't go on this route. There are many strong and dangerous Pokemon on it. Okay, well, we'll go right then. Right seems like the better route to go, I guess. There's probably some items I'm missing back there, too. I'll probably check it out off screen and see what I can find. And there's mm, weird Pokemon at this lake. Okay, that's great. He, that's not even at all what he said, but that's fine. Uh, I kind of don't want to fight a trainer, but let's go ahead. And... Pokemon should always be fit and ready for a battle. Well, let's see if my Pokemon are fit enough to take yours out. All right, let's go for a faint attack. That did nothing. Um, you know, let's actually switch. We're not going to be able to do much with that guy, so let's go for that Ember. Good game, Hater. And a Starly. Let's go Monroe and see. Do we have any? Yes, we do. We have Powder Snow. That's great. You're actually going to kill something? Good job. Oh, my goodness. I'm surprised. Two levels. Nice. Now she's about to send out a Bidoof, so let's go with Swaggy and just go for a low kick. Another low kick and one more finish him off. I didn't see what that was, but let's hope it was a Spearow. Yes, it was. Okay, good call there. One more Powder Snow, and that is GG. GG, a hater. I'm gonna keep him in, though, so we can get some EXP when I switch out to Gunter. So, alright. And an Ember. There we go. And we're level 6 with him. That's great. I don't really want to go all the way back, so let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon with potions. I really love what they've done with this game. I'm, I'm just gonna keep complimenting it, because it looks amazing. Alright, so let's go over here. Head right up here and fight this youngster. What do you have? Being trained is being prepared. I gotta poop. Okay, well that's great. That's awesome. I don't know why I gave him that voice. I'm actually kind of disgusted, but let's switch. Oh no, you poisoned our Pokemon. All right, let's go for an Ember. I really love that they put the fourth generation and fifth generation Pokemon in here. It looks, it looks awesome. Let's just stay in with this guy though, because we don't want to die. Gunter's level 15. Look at you. Look at you being all nice and pro. Alright, uh, let's go out to Monroe here and uh, Powder Snow this thing to death. Come on, we can do it. You can do it, man. I freaking believe in you. Oh god, we're gonna die, aren't we? No, we're not! You're an idiot! Yes! You're level 7 and we learned double team. Okay, let's just switch out to Gunter because he's got to finish the job here. You have to kill this thing. Please kill this thing. Yes, we killed it. Okay, we defeated that youngster. This is actually pretty hard. So let's go ahead and head back to the Pokemon Gym. No, Gunter's dead. Oh well. Uh, sorry for all the super speed, it's just I don't want to waste that much time, because I don't really have a freaking running shoes. You know, let's go ahead and talk around these houses, though, and see what's up. In this city, there are many buildings important throughout the Zephyr world. Okay, that's great. Uh, yeah, there are a lot of important buildings. When I grow older, I want to attend the University of Hose. Okay, that's great. What do you have to say? The first gym of Zephyr is located in Inhor, Inho, Inhor City uses bug Pokemon so you can win easily with a fire type well that's a good tip that's a really good tip and for ice types we can win easy with I don't even know what I'm saying these guys don't have anything I've been in their house before I think I've talked to you you give me an item right don't you no okay why don't you give me an item I remember one of these people yesterday I saw a combi that's great me too all right what do you have to say working in the mines is dangerous all right you don't have anything to give me what about you to learn a Pokemon secret just be their good friend okay well, it doesn't look like there's many important people here. Only one other person. Oh, an amulet coin. All right, that's good. Or an omelet coin or an amulet. I think it's amulet coin, but whatever. I can't freaking pronounce anything, so you guys should know this by now. All right, so we've healed our Pokemon. We've pretty much done a lot of things that we can do in the city. We've talked to almost everybody in the city. Oh, this guy gives you focus punch, so let's go ahead and talk to him. Your trainer, so I think you have something, some use for this, isn't? Yeah, it's Focus Punch. All right, see, that's good. That's good. We'll be using that later on. So let's go ahead and go up here. I'm really hoping we could get the running shoes pretty soon, though. I don't know where to get them. I don't know. I don't know if you can get running shoes in this. Really hope you can, because that'd be terrible if you couldn't. I love how Swaggy and freaking Monroe are the same level. Whoa! What? It's Ethan. Huh? See, Kinta. Feebash orange season. They appear to be, they appear by the thousands at this time of year. Although they are brave, they have rarely attacked people and rarely appear at other times. Very interesting, Professor. Thanks for the tip. I think I'll try to catch one. 
All right, try to catch one. Wow, I don't know how they do these cutscenes, but they're really nice. Are you gonna catch one or not, or are you just they're just gonna jump up and down? How long is this gonna last? <laughs> wow, amazing, Professor. I've fallen in love with these Pokemon. I'll catch one right now. Go, Pokeball! Oh, that's really cool. Look at he caught it. Wow, I captured Feebas. It looks like a good Pokemon. It sure does, you know. What? This Feebas is attacking me. Professor, I'll save you. Will he? Or will I save him? Yeah. I think I'll save him. I think I'll do it. Oh, look, I am I mean, I mean, am going to save him. What are you doing, Gold? I thought you were going to save him. Yeah, let's... Whoa, you get some legendary music here. Oh, God, that legendary Feebas. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> what is this? Let's just low kick it a couple times. I'm going to catch this thing, though. I just, I just want to catch it to have it. It's not going to be official team member, but hey, you might as well catch it. Uh, nickname him... Uh, let's nickname it like Sheila. That's the ugliest name I could think of. No offense to anybody named Sheila. I'm just, it makes me think of old Russian people. Uh, how are we gonna spell this? So we'll just spell it like this. I know people are like, mm, you misspelled that son of a. I don't care. Thank you. Uh, it's Tommy. Professor Jasmine asked me to come tell you what she's doing. Important research in creating the universe, blah, blah. She wants your help. She wants you to show her the results. She's in her lab in Yellowtown. Thank you, Tommy. I'll head there right away. Oh, and this is my nephew, Kenta. Nice to meet you, Tommy. You look like a skilled Pokemon trainer. I hope I'll face you and myself someday. I hope the same thing to you. Well, I'll be on my way now. Thanks, Tommy. Goodbye. Are you going to give me anything? Like, any drugs or anything, dude? No drugs? All right, no drugs. Well, either way, we just helped those guys out. I think I kind of want to head back to the Yellow Town, see what's going on there. And a Water Stone's over here. That's cool. Uh, let's fight this guy really quick, though. Oh, you don't even want to battle, do you? You punk. He doesn't want to battle. Let's go ahead and just super speed our way back to Yellow Town if I can. Whoop. Ugly sound. Ugly sound. Ignore the ugly sound. All right, let's go heal up. And I'm going to deposit that Feebass really quick. Let's go ahead and throw this away. We really did a whole lot of nothing this episode. I, I'm sorry. I'm new to this game, and it just it looks so visually appealing that I'm just... I'm just a stunned, so I really apologize for that. Hopefully it's still interesting somewhat for you guys to watch. Can I not go through that? I can't. Wow. Okay. Whatever. Just make me go through the freaking grass, punks. Punks? Alright, I don't want to encounter you either. And I might train up Scraggy and all of them to like level 15 just to match up Gunter's level off screen. But anyway, let's go ahead and go to Yellowtown and see what they're doing there. Alright. Uh, Professor Oak should be here, right? No? Okay, he's not here. Whatever. Oh, he is here now. How did I get here faster than you, dude? Whatever. Hi, Professor Oak. Welcome to my lab. Thanks, Professor Jasmine. Tommy told me I had to come here quickly. So I'm here to learn about your research. Yes, Professor. With Tommy's help, I've been studying the ancient writings about the creation of the universe. They said that Arceus created the world and all Pokemon... Incredible! This is actually related to my latest research in Pokemon DNA. It seems all species have the same small trait in common. Yes, Professor. Right. Now that's all I know. I'll send you the full document on CD. Okay, Professor Jasmine. I'm going to research. I'm going to my research center in Zephyr City Radio Tower. Radio Tower. Where's that? At? Zephyr City Central. Okay, we'll find that immediate. Let me know immediately if anything happens or you have any problems. Okay. You wait, dude. Give me something like drugs, maybe. I don't know, man. I just want some drugs. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right. Good job, Tommy. I've registered you in the Zephyr League. Now you can fight the eight gym leaders and become a powerful trainer. Congratulations. Take care. Team's team will be after you. Ooh, that's. That's not reassuring at all, so let's walk out of here. So apparently that was all a tutorial, but uh, at least we took some baby steps. Baby steps. Well, we got two new Pokemon. Uh, let's go talk to our mom, see if she'll give us some some shoes that we can run in. Hey, yo. Hey, you're the pride of my life. Yeah, I hate you too, you know? You're not giving me any running shoes. Let me talk to Professor Jasmine again, see if she'll freaking give me shoes. Give me shoes! Dang it! I don't like you anyway. Fine, punk. I bet once we leave the next town, they'll give us some running shoes. So let's go ahead and head up here. Wow, they don't give us any freaking running shoes. Let's... No, okay? I'm just gonna keep walking. Just keep going this way. I really want to freaking run, though. It'll save me so much more time that I won't have to super speed when I walk. But, oh, well, at least the routes are really close together. So it's not super bad right now. Super bad. It's a, it's a good movie. But no, at least it's not terrible right now running around and... And all that stuff. Oh wait, he's in the radio tower in Zephyr, in Central City. Let's go talk to him. He's right here. Should be right. Right. This is. No, that's the train station. What am I thinking? You're the radio tower, right? Please be the radio tower. Yes, you are. 
Let's go talk to Professor Coke. Um, cocaine. I don't even know. Professor Cocaine. Why did I say that? Hey, look, it's Ethan and that guy. Hey, Tommy, I'm glad you came to the research center. I have a gift for you from Kinta. It's a national dex, which you can find, record all your Pokemon on your journey. Wow, so good thing I did come here. All right, that's good. Oh, it's for both of us, so we're both starting out here? This is really cool. I, I really love this ha uh, this hack. Tommy received the national dex. Well, Kinta and Tommy. Now, use this tool, you can do the Zephyrs. Okay, we'll do Zephyr. Bye, Ethan, or Kenta. Why is your name Kenta? I don't even know. Are you going to give me a starter Pokemon? That would be great. Just give me some starters or something. Just by looking at you, you can see you have great potential as a Pokemon trainer. I'm going to let you choose one of these three rare Pokemon. Ooh. Ooh, Chikorita. Okay. It's going to let me choose the Johto starters here. So, okay. I will let you guys vote on the three Johto starters that you want me to pick. Uh, there's pretty much, you're just choosing between Chikorita or Feraligator or Totodile. So Chikorita or Totodile, go ahead and leave your comment below. And next episode, I will pick the Pokemon depending on your vote. So thank you all for watching. I will see you guys next time.